Two 13-year-olds from Reedsburg are facing charges after making a kill list with the names of about 20 students. Reedsburg school officials say there is no immediate risk of harm, but as News Street's Rose Schmidt tells us, parents say they should have been notified sooner. Rose? Well, Eric and Charlotte, as school safety continues to be a concern across the country and here in Wisconsin, the district administrator says Reedsburg schools are on high alert, but nonetheless, parents say the situation is scary to them and their kids, and some are even choosing to keep their kids home from school today. We live in a small town. We live in a town of less than 10,000 people. School safety seems to be an issue everywhere, the latest being in Reedsburg. We live in a primarily hunting town. There are, there's access to guns everywhere. That reality scares parents like Melissa and Starla, who both have sons at Webb Middle School. It's sad when kids nowadays have to be scared to go to school where it should be a place of comfort and everything, and it's not anymore. Police say two 13-year-olds from Webb sent a kill list to another student through Snapchat. But authorities say both students lacked the means to carry out a threat. I don't think there's anything about this issue that is presenting, um, you know, harm or risk to our students or staff at this time. District Administrator Tom Benson says parents were notified through an email and a text toward the end of the school day on Wednesday. We are informing you of a threatening situation that developed in our middle school today. But parents say they should have been told sooner. There's a lot of miscommunication. That it feels like this is being swept under the rug. For any who were left wondering whether their kids were mentioned. The police chief himself uh, made calls to uh, the parents of every child who was on the list. The school district also wants you to know they're taking this seriously. Student safety, staff safety, visitors to our buildings, uh, we want them all to be safe. But parents are left thinking about what would have happened if this incident hadn't been reported. With everything that's going on with school shootings, school stabbings all across the country, now Reedsburg is the ninth or tenth school in Wisconsin alone that's been affected by something like this. The two students involved face charges of making terrorist threats and disorderly conduct. Their charges will be forwarded to Sauk County Juvenile Court, and they could face disciplinary action at school. But the district administrator is not saying what that action could be at this time. All right, Rose Schmidt reporting that. Rose, thank you.